There was some bad information given out the last couple days that Lake Mead water levels dropped, plunged eight feet during an earthquake. It was a uh, a bad information. So we're going to set up. We're going to give you a little bit of good information today on the water level situation in Lake Mead. It is bad. Okay, the record level and um, water level, the most water ever put in Lake Mead was at, at 1,226. It says right there 1,219 max, but actually that says 1,219, but the max ever was 1,226. And we're right now at 1,077 feet above sea level. So we've had a drop of 150 feet. Now that's huge. A um, hundred and fifty feet drop in Lake Mead water levels from a one from the maximum the the record high of twelve twenty six down to what today's today's level is a record low of a thousand seventy seven. That is a hundred and fifty foot drop. It's just the implications are staggering. And um, this is because we had over over a decade of drought, and Lake Mead capacity is now about less than 40%. We're right around 38% of capacity. And uh, to make matters worse, the minimum depth you need to generate power from the power plant is 1,050. We're only about 27 feet away from not being able to produce power. The implications are staggering. So, yes, the, uh, the implications are staggering when you're talking about power, generating power. Um, because we, we're only 27 feet away from not being able to generate power. But most of that power goes to California, I believe. And uh, who cares about California? But I've got a solution for this. You may not believe it. I've got a video called The Water Wars Are Over. Yes, The Water Wars Are Over. You should watch that video. The water problems, as bad as this looks, we've got a 150-foot drop in water levels. We are now, because of my new plan, we can now have millions and millions more people come to this desert and live because of my new plan that I document in the water wars are over. So, uh, what I document and what I tell you in the video, the water wars are over, I give people the ideas on how we can change all the 85% land. It's owned by the federal government. The federal government owns 85% of all the land in Nevada. We can now sell these one, two acre properties to the poor people of America. And we can now, they can have homesteads out here in the desert where there's no water. We can have homesteads out here. And all they have to do is build a greenhouse behind their homestead. And we can now put in atmospheric water generators. The technology is now here that we can put atmospheric water generators in a greenhouse setting behind your house in the middle of the desert and have all the water you need for a family. The water wars are over. You should watch that video the water problems are over, people, when we use our mind. When we use our mind.